Hey, good morning, everyone. This is Seiko. It is the muscle toning December 10th, Thursday. All right, so I have uh, uh, five pounds uh, dumbbells on the side. I need a little pushback. Okay, all right. So let's start with the squat as usual, warm up. All right, so stand tall, your feet flat, on the floor and lift your body, squeeze your glute, round your shoulders and drop and lock it and go down and up. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Don't forget your knees not going to lock at the top, right? And your knees going same direction with your toes. And make sure your booty's going all the way back from the side of you. Keep your chest up. It's easy going down this way. You know, some people goes upper body lower, but not your booties. So make sure booties down. If you can, bring your booties almost to the level of your knees. Beautiful. Good. Give me eight. Seven, six, five, good job. Four, three, two more. Last one and hold. Drop a little bit, drop a little bit, and up. Still not going all the way up. Down, down, up. Down, down, up. Down, down. Up, down, down, two more sets. Down, down. You can do just a half inch small movement. Last one and hold in the middle. Good. And side to side. Be careful with your knees. You're going to shift your weight with the whole legs. Not just doing this, right? Your body move side to side. Four more. Three, shoulders away, two, tuck your tummy in, one, center and step forward and back. Step forward and back. One, two, three, four, keep your core tight, five, six, seven, Eight and hold, hold it, hold it. So you're on the lunge position, good. And step forward, one, but only your toes. You're not gonna shift your weights a whole lot, but partially, you feel the quads and go down. And step forward, down, step forward. One, two, ouch, three, you're gonna feel, four, four more. Three, two, one, and hold. Still lunge, right? And step to the side a little bit wider. Good. And forward. So it's closer to the line here, but wider. Good. And open your arms. Lock your shoulder blades and go down and up. Don't forget your tummy. As you go up, squeeze your glute. My left side, your right quads, really feeling it. Four more, keep your heels up. Three, two, one, and hold. And eight counts. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, back. Ready? So now you're gonna do the other side right here, right? And back. Forward and back. Forward and back. Last one. Next one. Hold and step forward. And back. Okay, here. 
forward, back, forward, step, back, forward, step, back, up, forward, step, back, up, forward, step, back, up, forward, step, and stay. One, two, three, four, four more, four, three, two, one, and back. And step side and a little bit forward. Good. And whew, arms out. One, two. Of course, your knees are not going lock all the way up. Still soft at the top, but a squeeze your glute, shoulders down. Four more, heels up. Three, two, one, and back. Oh, shake, shake, shake. Beautiful. All right, grab the dumbbells. Sip water anytime. We're gonna work on the shoulders, all right? So you can do without shoulders, right? Just the air weights. Good, so hold it on the side. We're gonna do, it's the shoulder and your back in the middle, right? Squeezing your shoulders to your ears. Doing opposite that I usually ask. Squeeze it, just like your tur turtle. You know, bring your head into the shell, but bring your whole back up and drop. And at the same time, heels up and down. Keep your core nice and tight. If you have any issues with the shoulders and can't do it, just do your legs. Good. When you lift your heels, you mean it really high and squeeze your glute. Good. Four more. Three. Drop. Two. You're going to feel all the heat around your neck, shoulder, and the back. And hold. Your shoulders still try to reach your ears, your, your rub. Okay, good. And small movement. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Heels up and drop. <sighs> One side, your right arms up, slightly lower than your shoulders, that's fine. And by the same time, you draw, pull down your shoulder blades, right? Don't forget, and draw in your navel. Good, and down. The other side, and soft elbows. And you can drop your weights when you start feeling really tired or too sore. Gonna focus on the middle section of your deltoids. Very important, focus on your muscle and visualize it. And just visualize that muscle, particular muscle growing, right? A little bit more toned if it's not bigger, right? Good, otherwise, but you're not gonna see the difference or you're, gonna, you're not gonna feel the difference. Beautiful. Last one. And right arm up and forward and down. Go up to the side and down. Left side, forward, down, up. And you can do without weight. Again. Out, forward, down, and lift up, side, down. To the side, forward, down, open, side, down. Good. One side, drop a little bit lower and a little bit above your shoulder, and down. The other side, from here, drop above and back and down. Shoulder level, drop, over 
and down. So every movement, connect with your shoulder blades in the back. Both together only four times. Up, lower, higher, slowly down. Again, up, lower, above, squeeze the balls in the armpits, lock it. Two more, up, down, above, resistance you feel, squeeze the balls. Last one, up, lower, above, slowly down, beautiful. Whew. And hammer curls. And if you can't do the arms and shoulders because your injuries, try to just the squat. And let's add the squats anyway. Up and down, down. Four more, four. Make sure your elbows are not moving forward. Two, one, and press up and down. And, oh, press up and down. Keep one side, good. When you go up, you don't lock your elbows neither. Four more, three, two, one, down, down, up, bring overhead, two, don't forget your core, you're not going to go like this, right, keep your toes so nice and solid, four more, three, two, one, back here, same thing, open your palms, Bring your elbows on the side, not forward here, and down, and up. And make sure your elbows are not sitting on the side, on the front side, slightly touched. And every time you lift, drawing your navel, and focus on your guns, your biceps. Squeeze your glute. Don't lock your knees. Good. Beautiful, four more, four, and three, good job, two, ah, one and hold. Now, you're gonna bring your elbows forward, beautiful, and you can drop your weight anytime and extend from the side and back here, forward and back. You feel much heavier, you're five pounds, Feels like eight pounds because your elbows are forward. Whew. Good. Extend and pushing back. Four more. And three, two, and one. Good job. Whew. And bring all the way up. Elbows tight on your side of your head. And bring your both dumbbells and up, inhale, exhale, exhale up, make sure you have enough space between your shoulders and your ears, at the top, extend your arms all the way, so squeeze your triceps, focus that, Four more, four, three, squeeze it, two, and one, just in case you have to see it, right? And here, good. And open your toes and lift your heels and bring your dumbbells back behind your head and up, up and extend. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Four more, three, two, ouch, one, and keep your heels up and extend your arms and up, 
make our part and just focus on your lower bodies now shoulders down up and down eight seven six five four three two one slowly down oh wow i'm getting warm how about you sip water all right let's work on your uh abs Go down to the floor and relax your arms. <clears throat> Good. All right. Inhale, bring your uh, feet down. Inhale, exhale, press the navel nice and flat. One more, inhale. Exhale, pressing down, so no space here. Good and bring your knees up one knee up and down so when you bring it it's a little bit easier for your tummy right kind of loosen up then press down as you move back your legs down inhale exhale this one really important you connect your mind to the muscle inhale Exhale, press the navel. Don't make the arch. Beautiful, both together. One. Knees together. Two. You focus. Make sure you don't make any arches as you feet down. Up and down. Two more. And down and add your upper body and down be careful two and down exhale and keep that flat oh, four more four and three no arch when you go back now two and one and hold and 16 one two three four five six seven eight more eight seven six five four three two one squeeze slowly down and extend your legs and now just extending your legs you might feel the arch on the lower back right here press down again and support your head flex your ankle inhale exhale press the navel all the way to the spine good and keep that lock it all right freeze it right here and lift your shoulders and down focus on your abs that's where you we're working all right exhale Exhale, beautiful, four more, and three, don't stick out your navel, and one, and bring your right heel on the top of the left heel, and same movement, one, exhale, up, three, and four and hold both your shoulders up extend your left le left arm opposite side of the legs right and bring your left arm pointing to the corner of the room and lift two you feel more on the obliques exhale four more three two one and hold and eight counts pause one two reach three four five six two more last one reach and slowly down did you feel it i hope so good and switch side yeah left the heel on the right toe and press the navel nice and flat straight up and down 
when you go down, touch your head, touch the floor, don't loosen up, right? Keep that nice and tight. Exhale. Four more. Four. Three. Two. And one and hold. Both shoulders parallel to the floor. Up and cross your right arm, pointing fingers to the corner. Four more. Three. Reach. One and hold and eight counts. Pulse. One, two. Reach farther. Four, three, two. Reach out. And down. Oh. How's everyone? Are you okay? Oh, okay. All right. So now you bring your um, legs up, uh, bend your knees and feet up. So straight up and flex and relax on the upper body. And first, you start with one leg. So starting with my left leg, lift up, your knees up, and pushing the bottom of the foot towards the ceiling and down. So make sure you don't make the arch. So press your navel towards the floor, nice and flat, squeeze your glute, right? And the other leg, pushing up, your knees up and down. Left leg, up the other side, push up. So pushing from the heel, focus on your glute and hammies. Exhale up, keep your knees 90 degrees, up, up, up. And both together now, both knees up and down. By the way, your feet are apart, not touching right now. Relax your neck. Four more, four, and three, two, one and hold, and extend your legs. Uh, keep your knees up. If it's too much, bring your knees down. But if you can, make a little space and extend. Inhale, extend, exhale, exhale. So you feel the glutes and hemis nice and tight. Squeeze your hemis, extend your hemis. Exhale. That's really important muscle to keep your glute in a place. And of course, all the overall all health, right? Good. Four more, four, ouch. And three, and two, good job. And one and hold. Keep your knees up and hold it, hold it. And lift your chest. Press the navel down. Squeeze your uh, ups and down. One more. Up and hold. And extend your arms. And bring your elbows towards the back, back side. Extend. Your arms are open to diagonal. It's about 45 degrees each side. Out. Elbows in and out. Last one. Hold and extend your arms to the side. Use your back, right? Your shoulder blades. And bring your hands to the shoulder and out. Keep your elbows on the shoulder level. Chest up. If you can't do this anymore, bring your toes down. Four more. Three, neutral neck. Two. Lock your shoulder blades. Up and down. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Down. Ouch. Let's work on the chest. 
Since we're on the floor, let's do the chest press. My favorite. So yeah, make sure you can build the you know uh, chest muscle. So your neck, when you wear the something open here, looks really nice, you know. So let's sculpt it. So same thing, everybody knows. Grab the dumbbell or no dumbbell. You can do that without it. Good. And all the way up above your chest. Good. And sticking out your chest, make the arch only the backside of the both shoulders down to the floor, all the way to the lower or the upper hip. Bring your elbows away from the chest. So now this is the time you stretch your pecs, your chest muscle and make sure you have a nice arch, strong, and push back up. Inhale, push your hands towards the center, but not touching it. As soon as you touch, you lose all the tension. Keep the tension all the stretched pecs and squeezing with the resistance. And I explained earlier before, right? Just imagine you have a plank between, you know, piece of a plank between your hands and pushing up towards the ceiling, parallel. So both evenly pressing up. Keep the arch, check that. Makes a huge difference. And focus on the chest muscle. Of course, you're using your arms and shoulders you feel a little tired, but the focus is still remaining on the chest. Four more, four, three, and two, squeeze your chest, and one, and hold. And that, it's above your chest, right? And pinky side, squeeze and twist, and now thumbs a little bit out and back, your palms towards your feet and bring your pinkies inward and out. Meanwhile, your arch is still there and you're still feeling your chest muscle squeezing. This twisting motion should be transmitted to your chest. By the way, if you have any more room to think, Press down your navel. Four more. Three. And two. And one. Bring down. Started with your right arm. Press up and down. Four more. Four. And three. Straight up and down. Use your triceps as well. Last one. The other side. Up. Four more, four, and three, two, good job, one. Joining with another hand, and we're gonna do the chest to fly, and pushing back. You can do without weight. Make sure your elbows are not locked. At the top, your elbows are still slightly bent, not bent like this, right? Straight arms, but soft elbows. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, bring the both chest into the center, but your dumbbells or your hands are not touching. Still have good distance. Four more, four, three. You're going to feel it. Two. And one and hold. Hold it, hold it. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. And slowly down. Good job. Oh. How's everyone? Doing okay? Shake, shake, shake. Ah. All right. So let's get on the plank position. Okay. And on your elbows. 
All right. And open your toes about hip width. So show me the good plank. So pressing with your elbow or forward. If you prefer to do on your hands, that's fine. If you wanted to do a little easier version, go on your chair or the bedside or the couch to bring your hands on so it's much easier for your shoulders as well. Good. And bring your heels in and out. So, but rest of your body is not moving. Your hips is not moving up and down right now. Heels, heels in and straight back up. So neutral neck, keep looking forward. Shoulders open. Inhale, what? exhale, inhale, and exhale, in, out, in, inhale. Exhale, and back. And keep the heels in. Squeeze your glute. Then we're gonna do pike. And flat. Up. Flat is not this, right? Up here. Open your shoulder blades. And up. Press the navel towards the tailbone. And four more. And three. And two. And one and hold. Whew. And from here, Open your heels and side to side. Up and side. Up, side. Up, side. Up. Four more. Three. And two. One. And hold. Whew. And bring your right knee down. Left knee down. Your knees down, lightly touch the floor, but your hips are not going up and down. Nice and solid. Whew. Last set, both together. Eight, seven, six. It's really tough when your hips are not moving. Four more, three, two, one, up, and down, relax. Oh, ouch. You feel it? Very good. All right, so last one. What's the best? I wanted to do the side plank. All right, on your elbow, good. And both together, right? Both feet, and if you want, Staggered, staggered, either way. And bring your hips up. If it's too much on your bedroom knees or here. And push the lower hips up and tap lightly. Don't relax here. Keep it tight and up and tap. Up and down. One, two, Make sure your hips are vertical to the floor and upper hip, try to reach to the ceiling. Four more, three, make sure your elbows, shoulders align, one and hold. Look at my hips, my upper hips is sticking out, good. And bring your arms underneath and reach and hold. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, Two, one, down. Ah, the other side. Either here, kind of mermaid, or all the way down. And you can support with your hands, right? I'm stuck, stucking, that's the hardest. You can do stagger. Ready? Press the navel. Make sure your hips are vertical. Up, pushing. Tap lightly. Up, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, beautiful, check your form, keep your upper body nice and tight, so your elbow is not hurting too much, not carrying too much weight, 
four more. And three, two, and one and hold. Keep pushing from the lower hips and go reaching as far as you can. Reach, reach, reach. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Oh, out. Go down. <sighs> All right. Last one. Just uh, squeeze your hips and powering, right? From there, extend and stretch your back and lower. Squeeze your uh, starfish, your inside, in the center of your hips, right? Squeeze, press down your navel and lift your hips, then a little bit up and drop. Lift and stretch and down. Two more, curling up and push, good, and down. Last one, curling up and lift your uh, lower back a little bit and hold. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, slowly down. Hug your knees. Woo. Stretch your lower back, your legs, and hold for eight seconds. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Extend your legs. Shake, shake, shake. Kick your booties. My butt worked hard today again. I still have soreness from the Tuesday and bring up and left leg down, corny toe, flex, circle, and reverse. Keep the straight leg if you can, you have to bend, it's okay. Bring your leg towards the chest so you feel good stretch on your hips and hamstring all the way to the ankle and check behind your knee. Make sure it's not too hard. Mine's pretty hard. That's why I have a little pain, shooting pain on my right side. So I gotta pay attention, whole leg, and massage with the palms to the corner. Press, press. Beautiful. Good. And bring your toes towards the shin and Massage the bottom of the foot. Good. And put your right hand, open your leg to the side. Your left side glued, stay on the floor. And bring your right leg towards the floor. And if you have to lift your left hips, that's fine. And keep your right foot on the floor and try to push down your left hips towards the floor a little bit. Good and bring back and extend your left leg, bend your knee and twist. Inhale, exhale. Good, back to the center. Figure four, put your foot on the leg, bring your left leg in. So now your right side of the loop, nicely stretching. Good, inhale, exhale. Right foot down, left leg up, pointy toe, flex. Circle, reverse. Keep the flex, bring your leg towards the chest so you feel good stretch. Hold back here and massage behind your knees. And you're gonna feel whole leg with your palms and all the way to the corner, pressuring. And all the way to the toes and bottom of the feet, foot, pressing with the fingers. Very beautiful. And put your hands inside and open your leg to the side and bring your leg, your foot down to the floor and you can lift the other hips. Then keep your foot down and bring your hips a little bit, just even a little bit towards the floor. That's your hip stretch. 
also hip flexors. Good, back to the center, extend your right leg, bend your knee and twist. Keep your shoulders down. Back to the center, figure four, put your foot on the leg, bring your leg in towards the chest. Inhale, exhale. Extend your legs, pointing toes, overhead your arms, bend your knee, flip over, facing down, and lift your upper body and lower. Grab the ankle or both ankles. Lift your knees. Quad stretch. Inhale. Exhale. Beautiful. Down. Child's pose. Right arm go under the left arm. Shoulders down. The other shoulders pushing down. Inhale. Exhale. The other side. Go under knees, left shoulders down, right shoulders down. Inhale, exhale. Beautiful. Good job. Sit down. Side to stretch. Right arm, your left arm goes to the side. Open your chest and facing down. Stretch a little more behind. And reach, reach, reach the other side. Stretch on your obliques, shoulder and armpits. Open your chest, facing down. Reach, reach, reach. Open, cross, drop your tailbone, shoulders down. Looking down, your back stretch nicely. Overhead, open, cross, chest, stretch. With your neck, stick in your lips. Good. And arm cross, shoulders down, head to the right. Again, the other side, shoulders down, head to the left. Good. Wonderful. Triceps to the side. Stretch on your side as well and facing down a little bit. Twist so you feel good. Stretch on the right here and back. The other side to the side and facing down a little bit. Inhale, exhale, back. Now deep breath twice. Inhale, exhale, everything. One more. Inhale. Exhale. Thank you so much, everyone, for joining me today.